channel so this is my nighttime routine I just got home from work and I'm probably tired and I'm gonna go ahead and take off all my jewelry and just get ready to lay down in the bed so I'm gonna go ahead and first light my favorite candle or one of my favorite candles right now from Bath & Body Works this is a stress relief candle and right now I'm just loving this candle how many do y'all think I actually have in my house because I definitely have more than one hmm take a guess then I'm going to go ahead and play some music. I always like to try to play something while I'm in the shower. Um, and then I'm going to turn the volume all the way up and just lay it right next to the shower. I need to go ahead and get me a shower speaker. Now I'm getting in the shower and just that fast, I am getting out of the shower. So now I'm going to go ahead and roll my sleeves up. This robe is super long. I don't know what's going on with it, but I like to start off with clean hands. So I take any soap I can find and clean my hands up before I even touch my face. I'm using any type of oil I can find, and this is just a really good oil to help take off any excess makeup, any dirt, any oils that are on your face throughout the day. I'm using my Dr. Bronner's Tea Tree Soap. You guys know that I'm loving this stuff right now. And I'm just going to go ahead and lather up real good on my hands and then just scrub my face. Now normally I probably scrub my face maybe two to three times and I get under my neck of course. And then I'm just going to rinse it with warm water and then follow it with cool water. Then pat dry only. Now I'm using one of the masks that I talked about in my other video. and This is just the Aztec clay mask and I always use apple cider vinegar, this brand only, to um, use it and mix it up. And I just put it on my face, try not to get it in your eye. And I kind of just put it on my cheek area, under my chin area. Um, I will do my other side of my cheek of course. And if you just happen to have any spots or any pimple areas that you see, problematic areas, I will go ahead and just place it there and just really try to smooth it out so you have a nice, clean, even layer. Sometimes I will let this sit on my face for maybe 30 minutes or so, and sometimes I have been known to fall asleep with this on my face. Once I finally rinse it off my face, I will put on some cocoa butter. This is just to help with any dark coloration, or I'll use a nice serum. And then if I see any pimples or just any areas of concern, I will go in with the Vicks Vapor Rub. And this is just good because of the eucalyptus oil and the menthol that's found in this. It also helps with any swelling or any pain that pimples can cause. Or another option, a triple antibiotic ointment, also known as Neosporin. This is good because it can help prevent infection in the wounds. And it has been known to speed up healing and help prevent scars. And the last thing I like to do before I go to sleep is take my diffuser, just put some water in it and some simple lavender oil. That is all for this video. Make sure you subscribe and I will see you guys tomorrow. Good night.